Hey, what's going on guys? I wanted to sort of shove this video in between uploads because I think it's super important if what I'm theorizing is correct, which I think there is some suspect evidence to point towards the validity of my claims to say the least. So basically the summer update for Temtem is nearing, though we still don't have uh, a true exact date and uh, parts of the spring update were actually left out. So while it may seem unlikely that the summer update is coming soon at a first glance, what I'm about to go over might just change your mind. So first of all, the Temtem official Twitter tweeted out this, with their final evolutions on the horizon, it's time to ask the question, who's the best starter? And then they had a poll. The poll is set to end around sometime tomorrow morning. Interestingly, when the spring update launched, it was uh, April 8th at 8 a.m. EST, so not too far from the end time of this poll. Now, I could be completely wrong about that, and it could just be a coincidence, but there's something about the terminology they used here. On the horizon, as in, this is coming soon. It just it, This Twitter poll is very suspect. It's also not the only piece of information to support the idea that perhaps Kisi was coming out. If you go over to the Temtem Discord and browse any of the trading channels, you may notice something different. The slow mode has been increased from 1 hour to 6 hours, almost as though expecting a huge influx of people trading. I've been a very active user in the Discord when it comes to trading and whatnot, and it was fine with an hour. There was not a significant amount of people posting to justify an increase to this magnitude. Now, a potential counter-argument to this, again, would be that we didn't get the full spring update. However, if you do look at what's left over from the spring update, it's basically just clubs and the in-game chat. It's not that far-fetched to think that they would just bundle that with the Kisiwa update. Having a separate update just for clubs and chat likely wouldn't really bring anyone back to the game, but having those two features coupled with an entire new island definitely would. I don't see it making logical sense for Krema to hint at the final evolutions of the starters without it being some sort of hint. It would otherwise get people hyped for no reason. They didn't have to mention the final forms in that poll. They could have easily just said, who's your favorite starter? Now, another possibility is that perhaps Kisi was not coming and their level cap's gonna increase, but that sounds a little strange. Like, why would they increase the level cap for no reason? I'm guessing they wouldn't do that. With regards to the level cap, I think we're probably going to see around level 60 or 64 being the, the new level cap when Kisiwa does launch. Now my only complaint is if this update comes, they gave us no notice and I would have booked a day off work for it. So that's my only complaint, just, just give me notice when these things happen, please. Some of us have jobs. Now, there is another possibility that I figure I'd go over while I'm here, and that's perhaps that the Kisiwa update isn't ready, but instead, in order to get a little bit of hype going, they're gonna reveal one of the starter evolutions, and perhaps the winner of this poll will be the starter evolution that we get to see, but that's just a theory. But anyways, guys, make sure to let me know what you guys think of this situation. Do you think Kisi was right around the corner? And on a side note, we just hit 1,000 subscribers yesterday. I can't express how grateful I am to those of you who watch my content, but I'll save all my gratitude for our 1,000 subscriber special video that I want to sort of try to get out next week at some point. I have videos scheduled for upload each day, I don't want to spam you guys with double uploads. Uh, I'm likely going to post this video on Sunday asking for you guys to ask me any questions you have, then I'll follow it up with another video answering those questions. We're, we're also taking questions in on the Discord if you're not part of the Discord. I also want to take the time during that video on Sunday to sort of shout out some smaller channels that I enjoy watching and sort of spread the love if you would. But anyways guys, thanks for watching again and stay tuned uh, later today at 1pm EST. We're going to have a video going over Monster Sanctuary. And with all that being said, make sure to like, subscribe, follow me on Twitter, GymLeaderEd, and until next time, peace.